<laughs> Your daddy's working, isn't he? Your daddy's working. You ain't supposed to pet no other dogs, Daddy. Yeah, I'm not supposed to pet nobody. He pet someone? I did, Tuck. I'm sorry. Hey, YouTube. Camper Van Kevin here. Well, today, I'm at my welder in Idaho. Yep, thought my welder would be able to see me over the weekend. Nope. <laughs> you got to be flexible. You got to go with the flow. If not, you get yourself all agitated and tore up and try to swim upstream. I was excellent swimming upstream. Not anymore. But, uh, uh, back down to his shop. He's right here. Uh, you, you can hear the, the flowing water from the shop. So I thought I'd take you up here and let's go take a look at it. He's in a very rural part of Idaho as well. I think my welder is in his probably mid-80s. Heck of a nice guy. Heck of a nice guy. He's got his shop next to this. I'd love to have my house next to this. This is his dog. I think he said her name was, Sa is your name Sadie? Is it on your tag? Let me see. Nope, she's a fetching fool. Sweet thing, sweet, sweet baby. You know, there's gold in these creeks up here. There's a lot of gold up in this area. All this area has been mined and sluiced or whatever they do to it. And there's still people that's got claims all up and down this river. Where, where's it at? You got it? Is it in your mouth? No. Where'd you drop it? At my foot. <clears throat> you want it? Can you catch it? Yay! <laughs> yeah! You must have a sweet daddy because you sure are sweet. Yeah, you got a good master. You got a good master. Good girl. Good girl. He also does some, uh, he cuts logs and everything. Cuts, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Cuts lumber. Got a little 53 ton, ton and a half log truck up there. Still running. Still works it. Baby, I'm making a video. Can you talk? I'm lift, lifting that foot, pointing at me. I'm going to kick it. How about that? Let me have it. Let's kick it again. Oh, she's fast. You healthy. You fast and pretty. Here's a sawmill. Got some of the prettiest lumber in there. Oh, there's a shop down here. Miss Gypsy sitting down here. That stream is flowing right along right along down beside us. It's fun backing down here this morning. The sun and the shadows got a hold of me. And I uh, I got too close to this tree right here. And I run one of these limbs down the side of Miss Gypsy. It'll, uh, it'll buff out, it'll come out. It marked it just enough. I thought it was on the, on the roof, but it wasn't. I 
it's not too terrible bad. Just barely scratched her. Any scratch is too much. Man, I told you that wasn't on the roof. I told you I was on the side. I can hear everything. He can hear pretty good, Daddy. I, I thought it was the roof. I got me another light like the one I had. It quit charging. So I brought a brand new one, and I'm going to put my old one in this box and send it back. It's Walmart. They take it back without the box, but good, good light. I think something happened to the charger. But either way, for $65, I didn't have it long enough. So I got a new one. And if you notice the angle of Miss Gypsy, the back end was setting pretty pretty far down. Anytime your RV is at a bad angle like that, you got to cut your, your refrigerator off. It'll ruin it. You know, maybe maybe for a minute or two, but don't don't risk it. You didn't have any choice but to park this way to get close enough to his welder. So cut off your fridge. Unless you want another one, buy another one. I don't. Got my motorcycle right here. Had a good time up there at Whoop 'em Up Campground in my last video. I had over 40 minutes of footage and whittled it down to 22 minutes. <laughs> I had to cut all the motorcycle riding out. But it was a good it was a good trip. <laughs> Your daddy's working, isn't he? Your daddy's working. You ain't supposed to pet no other dogs, daddy. Yeah, I'm not supposed to pet nobody. He pet someone? I did, Tuck. I'm sorry. What's what you got? What you got? Take the center one out. Okay. It'll be, uh, be pretty heavy duty. You got a lot of material here to uh, hang on to it. This uh, stack here? Yes, sir. Help yourself. You got it down. That's that. Yeah, we're getting this thing to dry. What kind of wood is this again? Jack pine. Yeah, it's all jack pine. Jack pine? Yeah. What it's do people? Pretty common around here. What do people do with it? Oh, there's a shed there for one. Building a shed with it. Uh, and the other pieces are the oh, we build boxes. We build. Um, then we, we were talking yesterday how people built tables. Oh yeah, a lot of tables and benches. I'm gonna. I'm going to build a, a bench out of this uh, piece of walnut here. Well, can't remember if it's that piece back here, I think. And then there's another piece back over here. But yeah, yeah. They managed to have fun. It's pretty. You mess with wood and metal. Yep, yeah. yeah. That's the problem with me. I got too much going on. <laughs> it's just. Uh, well, if you enjoy it, that's it makes it all worthwhile. Yeah. Had to put had to put these pins on the outside because of the way the bumper fit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We had to go on the outside here because of the wasn't any room. The bumper, uh, the uh, bumper mount. The bumper mount on the inside, so but it'll make it easier to get these out without yeah. having to. No, ain't that the truth? I got a little bit of paint in there now. It's crazy paint with me. All right, I'll leave you alone. Let you work. It's all right. We're good here. Coming together real good. It'll be. Uh, it'll be a lot more stable. I got everything jacked up here, and and then. It works in tight against this one here, you see. Mm -hmm. 
And but uh, when it comes back down on top of this tube here and that tube over there, we're gonna be looking real fine. Good deal. Oh, these quarter inch tubes here, my gosh, they're uh, good for 5,000 pounds each. So you're plenty good. What's your dog's name? Sadie? Sunny. Sunny? Her name is Sunny. I didn't call, call you. <laughs> you did too. Sunny. S S O N N Y. Sunny. <laughs> I know your name now. I know your name now. Your name is Sunny. Your name is Sunny. Your name is Sunny. There's that old Chevrolet ton, ton and a half. I grew up on the farm. We had a red one. That's a five window. Gosh, that's a very rare truck. And he said it's on the road. They use it. 52 or 53, I think he said. It's got some kind of boom on there for logs. It's a rare truck to begin with, but with that five windows, I don't know if I've seen one. I can't remember the last one I saw. Got a bunch of farm implements here. This one you ride. Look at those wheels. My guess, some kind of loads hay. I don't know. It's gear driven. Boy, the sun is bright today. It's gear driven. I think it I think it loads hay. That's my best guess. What do you guys think? Get out of the shot, Kevin. <laughs> we had a bunch of old farm implements around our farm, but I've never seen this. Never seen anything like it. Get out of the shot, Kevin. Y'all all know what I look like. Little Sunny there, she just gets to go wherever she wants. Dog being a dog. She's gonna go down to the creek, get her a drink of water. Come on, Sunny. You get you some water? <laughs> Old Sunny here has gotta be pretty tough. Hang with all these coyotes and wolves and stuff up here. It's the kind of dogs we had on the farm. We let them run free. Can't do that with a wolf pack. They're too tiny. Look how close I look how close I come to this equipment right here. Backing up. <laughs> yeah. Too close. Alright, well he uh he primed it and I had some some black spray paint. I put some black on it, keep the rust off of it. Look how solid that is. I was just afraid that bike was gonna come off and go through somebody's windshield. And she's solid now. I'm not happy about that little limb getting me. But you know, makes me glad I don't have a $100,000 RV. I am certain that it'll wash off or buff out very easily. Still not happy about it. But I am very happy about this. Three points make a plane. So does Boeing. I, uh, I gotta touch up 
a little bit down here on the bottom. He got a little overspray on my RV. I got something to wipe right off. I got some goof off. But uh, he primed the metal and I painted it black. He, uh, <clears throat> he put a jack underneath this Z bar he had made and lifted up this whole thing. I almost, once I cinched it down, I had room, but you couldn't put your finger between the top of this brake reservoir and the bottom of this mini split rack. I mean, maybe my pinky finger, maybe. Talk about, oh, so close. But it fit. Yeah. Here's the other side. I'm gonna show a video of it shaking, me shaking it before these three, before the other two points were added. Now I'm gonna show this one. I'm moving. The rack's not moving, I'm moving. A lot more sturdy. 10 times more sturdy, 100 times more sturdy. Yeah, I got it off eBay. It's either rated five or 600 pounds. I don't think so. <laughs> if it breaks, who do you complain to? By then, you, you got worse problems than, uh, than dealing with them. Okay, time to end this little video. So I'm gonna end it right here. I appreciate each and every one of you. Thank you guys so much for watching my videos. Hey, we'll see you again soon. You guys take care. Bye-bye. What's your dog's name? Her name? Sunny. Sadie? Sunny. Sunny? Her name is Sunny. Her name is Sunny. I didn't call, I didn't call you. <laughs> you did too. Sunny. S-O-N-N-Y? -S yeah. Sunny. <laughs> I know your name now. I know your name now. Your name is Sunny. Your name is Sunny. Your name is Sunny. <laughs>